Hey guys, so once again, we're here at Overland Expo East 2023, Virginia. My name is Oba. I'm with Lewis Inca 4x4, and today we have... Aneta. Aneta. Mm -hmm. And Aneta is going to walk us through some of her products and how much, why she like the product, how she uses it, all of that. Yeah. Okay, so I'm here at uh, Overland Expo East this year with Dect for the second year in a row. Uh, showcasing our drawer systems. This is one of my favorite things that I ever put in the Jeep. Um, it keeps all of my camping gear organized, dry, dust free. This is the camp kitchen and like little camp stuff area. And then these are tools, recovery gear, and anything I would need to kind of fix the truck on the trail. Um, I've had it for three years. This is enough for me. It's a great amount of storage. And yeah, the platform is strong. And then I was able to build out the back of the car off of the platform. So I have the fridge. Everyone's been asking about this. It's a tilting fridge slide so I can see into my fridge. So it's a lot better because the deck will raise your fridge for, you know, so you won't be able to see inside of it. So you really kind of need the, the tilting unless you're, I don't know, seven feet tall. <laughs> so yeah, so that's the, that's the inside over here. This is my newest addition here, the Extrusion Overland bed rack. It's aluminum. It's a fully modular system. You can, you will not find anyone else with the same setup as you do if you order this rack. Basically, it's endlessly customizable. You have a slide out on this side. I made that grab handle by myself. Guys, she also, <laughs> um, she went DIY and she built this on her own. And actually it's very practical because Let's say you're a tall person or you're a short person. If you're a short person, no offense, you'd be able to slide this in and out. Mm -hmm. So you'd be able to reach inside the Jeep and yeah. pull this out and it will, it works just perfect. Yeah. This is one of the eye catchers. A lot of people have been asking her about this feature right here. And uh, actually, I think it's been a, a great idea. Yeah. Uh, very creative. Yeah, I love it. Uh, I love it. It's, it was, yeah. it was, um, it's kind of a complicated install because it's so, you know, intricate, but once it's all put together, tightened up, it is solid. It's 70 pounds as compared to my previous rack, which was like 150 pounds of steel. So you definitely feel the difference. Um, this side is awesome. This is the uh, Midnight Forest eight gallon water tank, but I put it on one of the uh, access gates here. So these they just stay up and now I have access to the back of the car, which I actually never had before. I would have to kind of reach in here and I would almost never use this space. It's kind of dead space. So I've, I'm obsessed with this right now. <laughs> so I'm still actually planning a couple other additions to it. I'll put a rear slide here and I'll be able to pull something out this way. I was thinking max tracks or some sort of traction board, an ax, something slim that I could still see out the window. Um, yeah. So, you guys want to go inside here? Yeah, she Hi. also, uh, guys, she also did a, a rear seat delete, which is getting very popular. Uh, it actually adds more room to your rig, uh, especially if you're a two person or mm -hmm. a person with a dog or a yeah. person with a dog, you'd be able to carry a lot of extra gear. And uh, so this uh, is this is from Cargo Dog and. This is a really simple install. You just pull out four original bolts that your bench seat came with, pull it all out and drop these in. And you just reuse those bolts. So it's awesome. really simple. They pop up, they're lit up as soon as you open them. Nice. Uh, this is marine grade carpet. It's, it's easy to clean. It's not, you know, it's comfortable for my dog. That's really what I got it for is because he would always fall off that bench seat because he's too tall. And they're all separately lockable, so they each have their own set of keys, just in case you send someone to your car to get something out, and you might have a firearm in there or whatever it is. Yeah. Um, they can only open the one you gave them keys for, but this is also aluminum. It's really light. It's really light. I really love it. Guys, this is a great feature to add to your car if you're uh, thinking of doing the de uh, yeah. bed delete or rear seat delete. It adds a great platform, like she was planning. She keeps her dog right here. Mm -hmm. He has great space to mm -hmm. walk around, move around. And yeah, this is this is one of the greatest features that's yeah. been uh, popping up around lately. And uh, she recommends it 100%. Oh, yes. Yeah, well, we take super long road trips and he goes nuts if he can't be comfortable. So I'll just put his bed, bed down on that. He falls asleep right away. Like that's where he's meant to be. 
Awesome. Okay, and here is the tent. This is the penthouse. Uh, this is the Alpine 51 inch from Tough Stuff Overland. This is my third tent, and I think it's my final one at this point. So <laughs> it is actually, it's really cool if you come see it from the side because the Z, you'll see like the Z skeleton of it helps you, actually lets you run it as a wedge. And then if you need the, if you need the space, you want to pop it all the way up, you have it all the way up. Okay. So the struts are pretty strong on that. Um, very easy to, un to deploy and fold down. The mattress is super thick. And my favorite part is that it's completely blacked out, pitch black. Like you cannot see your hand in front of your face. <laughs> it's really, it's really comfortable, mat uh, comfortable tent. Yeah, guys, uh, tough stuff overland. Go check them out on the website. Yeah. Uh, they have awesome products. And uh, yeah, this is a great setup for yeah. here though. She also has, she has a lot of gear that we can go all day long with it. Yeah. Yeah, and, uh, it's not just the camp stuff. It's also, yeah. the axles are built out a little. It's got a brand new suspension from Icon, hydro steering, um, locked front and rear, chromoly axle shafts, gear down with Yukon. Like there's a lot of stuff going on because I want to take it off road, you know? <laughs> she's, she's very well prepared when it comes yeah. to camping. And uh, it almost looked like a, a very well done rescue vehicle in my opinion. It's, yes. I, I love this thing. Uh, this is so beautiful. Like she say, you can add a lot of stuff to the rack. Mm -hmm. You also have hanging points. Mm -hmm. uh, you can use this little gap as hanging points. Like uh, we also have a, a friend of mine, a uh, guy I'm working with, right. my friend Louis with Inca 4x4. Uh, he has a trash route. She also carries a trash route. Right. Uh, you can use the rack to hang your Wait, trash Wait, but do you want to just come see that trash route I showed up with? Yeah. <laughs> Compared to this okay. one. No, Look at that. Yeah. That's way nicer. <laughs> no yeah, UV yeah, damage. Yeah, so years, I'm just happy. I'm happy for yeah. this upgrade. It's awesome. Yeah. So it, he was telling me it's got three, it's got three different compartments in here. And there's a back step here to get into the back. And I love that you could cinch it down. So yeah. what I, I had a really good, someone told me a really good idea. So I didn't know how to store that tire, uh, tire table. So she told me, pack it up and put it in this and yeah. stick it up there. So that's what I'm going to do. I have a cover now for it. And now, now I'm happy. But also I'm just going to use it as a garbage bag. Cool. Yep. Yep. Awesome. Neda, thank you for your time. Thank, thank you. Thank you for walking us through. Thanks for your, listening to my Jeep stuff. Beautiful Jeep. <laughs> uh, like I say, this is a great, awesome vehicle. I, I, thank you. I, I can go on with words about your how beautiful your car is. Thank you. It was great meeting you this you time. You too. Uh, this is my first time meeting you, my second time at the expo. And uh, thank you so much. Yeah, thank and, you. Uh, I want to go overlanding with you guys in Georgia. Sure. Yeah. So let me know when your next trip time. is. Yeah, thank you so much. Yeah. And uh, that's it. Okay. Is that okay? Perfect. Thank you. What? Oh.